Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to fold an angelfish. This is a traditional model. I'll be using a 6 inch sheet of kami. And we're going to start with the colored side down. Next we'll valley fold in half along both of the diagonals. So we'll bring this top right corner down to the bottom left corner. Make sure those corners line up and then hold them in place and then crease all the way across. And then unfold. Next bring the top left corner down to the bottom right corner. And then crease that one. And then unfold again. Next we'll turn the paper over. Now we'll bring the top edge down to lie along the bottom edge. That'll form a valley fold that runs right through the center of this X here. So make sure both of those corners line up and then crease it all the way across. And then unfold. Next we're going to form all of these creases at the same time. So you'll need to pick it up and then make sure the center of this X is going to point upwards. And then you just press on the two sides here, bring those together. And then you can push all of this together and lay it flat. So it should form a triangle and then press everything down firmly. Now it should be symmetrical. There should be two flaps on the right side and then two flaps on the left side. Next we're going to make a valley fold that starts at this top point and runs down this way. And it's actually going to trisect this angle um, so we'll bring this over and valley fold it. Try to get it into thirds so that this is the same size as this. And it's okay if it's not perfect on the first try, just make sure it starts from this top point. And I'm going to fold it a little bit too far on the first one just to show you how to fix it. Next we'll be bringing this edge over to this edge and so we'll fold right along this edge here and you'll notice it doesn't go all the way over because I folded it too far the first time so I'm going to unfold this and then we'll have to slide this over a little bit so I'm just going to push here and it will roll the paper over and then I'll form a new crease and then we'll try again this time it's almost perfect, which honestly that's close enough. You can fix it and make it perfect if you'd like, but it's really not necessary. But just try to get it really close so that when you fold that over, this edge lies along the edge beneath it. And once you have it where you like it, then just turn it over and they're all done. And you can put an eye on the front if you'd like. And now we have a little angelfish. Uh, if you liked this video, make sure to subscribe. There'll be a lot more tutorials in the future. But thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time.